In this video, I'm going to show you how to record your dividends in tally accounts. Firstly, all we need to do is click on the bank module on the left hand side of the screen. Once we click into the bank module, all we need to do is select the relevant bank that the payment's gone out from and click view and add. All we then need to do is type the date of the transaction. So I'm just going to go and put start January and under the code, just start typing dividend and you will see that you have code 3500 for dividend paid. Then all you need to do is put in the comment. So we're just going to say this is a quarterly payment. And I'm just going to put Jan in there. Money going out, so the amount that the dividend was, so I'm just going to put £4,000. And the VAT rate needs to stay at NA because it's non-applicable. And then hit the plus sign on the right hand side. We will now see if we scroll back to January in my bank, we can see that that dividend has been paid and we can see the amount has recorded in the bank. We just going to repeat that process for as and when we take them out. So we're just going to say this is going to be from the 1st of April. And again, just type in dividend. And then we're just going to put in here quarterly payment. And I'm going to put April in there. Money out. I'm just going to put 5,000. VAT rate again, leave it NA. And then hit the plus sign on the right hand side. And now that has been logged in my system. To report on that and track that, all we need to do is click on the reports module on the left hand side of the screen. Under general reports, if we go through to our balance sheet, run our balance sheet report in here, we will now see if we scroll down under capital and reserves, we've got our dividend paid, logged in here and we can see our minus £9,000 figure in here. We can also drill into that on the right hand side. So if I open that up in the window, we can now see we've opened up our nominal ledger and I'll be able to see all of the reports that I've got in here, the references, the narrative, so all of our payments listed and how much they were. We can also see that directly from the trial balance. So if I go into reports, scroll down under general reports, click into our trial balance, run the report, we will now see in here 3500 dividend paid and I can see my £9,000 going out from there. And we can also drill into the nominal ledger from the trial balance. And that's how easy it is just to log, record and track and report on your dividends using tally accounts.